Alrighty guys, welcome back to Let's Play Legend of Mana. In the last episode, um, the inspector was too late, and we, a nun hit this guy that's laying on the ground in the chest, took out this jewel that sparkles, and I, I think he's going to die. Give yourself up, Sandra, and take that weird, take off that weird hat. No, it was a nun. <laughs> Sandra is a master of disguise, but I will catch her. I don't think nuns kill people. That's just my opinion. Diana, I wish I could see you again. I'm sorry. Well, it's okay. After the lag, he's going to die. Yep, that's the end of the ruby night. And now we're back in the temple. See, all this is, is back and forth and back and forth. And as the screen eventually comes back down, the temple received a note from Sandra, the jewel hunter. It said she will steal the flame of hope. I thought she meant the sacred torches, but she was after Mr. Reuben's core. If only I'd known that he was a Jumai, Jumi, Jumajuba. We must catch Sandra no matter what. I need your help. Will you corroborate? Nope. Yeah. Yeah, I will. Oh, thank you. You're welcome. Something tells me that Sandra is still around this area. You search. I will search the temple and the village. You go check the outskirts. Let's go. Oh, uh, yeah. Make me do all the hard work. After the lag, we're going to go check the outskirts. We finally get to do some fighting. I know how boring the past two episodes have been, besides the little dub bears pissing me off thing, but we finally get to go fight. Maybe. There we go. Hopefully I can get this event done in this episode. Leave once you are finished. Okay. All you want to do here is follow the sproutling leaves. You don't have to pick them up or anything. Just follow them. <clears throat> Whoa, are those those shadow things? No. They are, but they're a lot, lot weaker than the ones we fall. Or I'm just a lot, lot stronger. No, they're, they're a weaker version of them. A Jinobi rock. I don't know what that is. Follow these leaves up here. It kind of becomes unclear where the leaves take you in a little couple more screens, so who knows. I might not get lost. I might get lost. I don't know. Whoa, what are those? Rattler Boa. Rattler Boa. Whatever. At least we're finding new enemies. Come on, experience. Oh, I don't want two items. Lizard scales and lizard meat. See, this is what I'm saying. I don't know which way to go. I guess we need to get on that side of the rocks. Gato Caves. Well, there's more leaves here, so this must be the right way. Can't go that way. Can't go that way. Let's go down here, then. Uh, is that an axe beat? No, needle beat. Die, you bird. Oh, dang. Go, bud. Took him out in one hit. There's some leaves there. Well, let's go up here, then. If there's leaves there, we must go this way. Well, we share it with anyone who has a barrel in their soul. Well, that's good. We are making the blessed elixir here. The sacred water is imperative for the temple's rituals. Yeah, that'll have more meaning later in the game. We got a blackened bat and a wad of wool. Well, that's great. Some weird items in this game, but, you know, I ain't gonna say anything. Alright, let's kill y'all again. But yeah, we'll be having more to do with that little cave a lot later in the game. Let Bud kill him off. 
and pick up his experience. Thank you, bud. Now I want to head over here and fight a big tree. The wooding. Alright. I don't feel like messing with it. Oh, I guess I could show off my magic. I forgot I got that. See, this is how it's done. You hold it down. And that little thing under my health will shoot up. And you gotta charge it, basically. After it gets charged, it'll, you know, shoot. It'll shoot the magic off. Alright, we made it through there. Now what? There's a waterfall. Well, that's pretty. It's the Pathways of Incentium. I don't see any more leaves. I am going the right way, right? Oh, I hope so. That would make me mad if I wouldn't. Oh, there we go. There's the nun and... Or is that Sandra and the Sproutling? Really? Yes. After he knocks him out again. Oh, more company. Now I have you, Sandra. No one will ever catch me. Ta-ta. Couldn't I just, like, kill her right now? Blast it, the Cancun bird. My tummy doesn't hurt anymore. Well, that's good. <laughs> oh, shut up. This is no time to celebrate. Another Jew Mai was murdered. This is horrible. I appreciate your help. Please take this. The ancient tablet artifact and the tor touch of torch of coral artifact. Sandra, I will catch you one of these days. Yeah, but it won't be for a long time. So that's the flame of hope, the end. Uh oh, we got a little tree growing up there now. Alrighty. Now that we've got a touch of coral, I guess I can't put that in the water. Oh, I gotta put it right there, okay. Well, we'll do that then. That's pretty neat. Ah, a pretty beach. Medora's Beach. The ancient tablet. Let's lead that a little further away from the house. No, I can't go any further that way. We'll put it right there then. Whoa. That's the Mendus Ruins. Oh, alright. Now that I'm thinking about it, now that I have magic, I can tell you what the little things in the bottom left corner mean. Um, let's see. I could do that. No, I'll just tell you. Alright. When you're at a place and you have that magic element with you, those represent how strong each thing is. See right there, the Jin spirit, which is wind and thunder, would be very strong right there. The fire's pretty strong, it's medium, and you can see the wisp and the, the first one right next to the shade element is not as strong. And the gold, I think it's Lumina, I don't know. The one in between Dryad and Salamander, Salamando, whatever his name is, he's not strong at all. He'll just have very little effect. But if you get a Gen 1 and you take it there, you equip them properly, you know, you can switch them out, that'll be a lot stronger. That's why, uh, that's why he, I think Bud was using Dryad, which has one little thing up there. Uh, so it wasn't horrible. I don't know how it killed it in one hit, but there we'd want um, Undine and Jin. There it wouldn't really matter. There we'd want Shade. There we'd want Shade, definitely. There we'd want Salamander, really anything, even Gnome. Uh, let's see. You can see there, Gnome, Dryad, Undine, Undine, whatever it is. Uh, there's Wisp. We'd use him there. There's Dryad. Definitely use Dryad and Gnome there. A lot of Earth things there. And there we just do whatever we felt like. <laughs> but that's how magic levels up, I guess you could say, in this game. There we'd use Dryad, Shade, Salamander, Gnome. And there we'd use Shade or Gnome or 
Well, you, you can you can see. You understand what I'm trying to say. But uh, this has been the Tigers of Here signing off. Let's play Legend of Mana. In the next episode, we are going to explore the jungle. Thanks for watching, guys. Stay tuned for the next episode. Have a good day.